strongest typhoons in the world, world right across the Philippines. And we sent, I think, 50 to 20 naval vessels from multiple countries to provide humanitarian assistance disaster relief for this super typhoon. Next. Uh, Lieutenant Palmer. Favorite Agro, sir. Favorite Agro. Thank you. So they, you know, we're going to get simulating waves near shore. This is a Oahu or a simulating wave near shore. This is what's the big wave height or it's wind fields. So we have advanced, you know, fully empowered to use the sortie guidance, be it a mod storm location and the sortie times that the U.S. will promulgate to make your ship sick. Uh, the sortie commander, if a sortie was ordered, the actual commander for the conduct of that sortie, again, directive to U.S. units and available to partner units would be... So I'm uh, Commander Joe Haynes from the Royal Australian Navy and my role here at RIMPAC is as the Commander Combined Task Force or CCTF Meteorology and Oceanography METOC Director. So I'm sitting in that three-star headquarters that is responsible for the coordination of METOC assets across the entire theatre, be it air, surface, subsurface and land. Okay, so the purpose of the uh, METOC Symposium is to provide training to all of our uh, METOC officers across the entire um, fleet at RIMPAC. So we have METOC officers uh, from all of the subordinate fleet units, from the task uh, groups and the task forces um, and we're getting together to give them oversight of the kinds of products and services uh, that we can provide holistically across all of the nations participating in RIMPAC uh, from both the meteorology and the oceanography side of the house. Um, so for RIMPAC 2022, METOC is a key enabler to the warfighter so what we're providing is not just a weather or an oceanography forecast, we're providing the so what to the warfighter of how the environmental conditions are impacting operations, be it at the tactical, the operation or the strategic levels. So that gives us an idea of where to uh, best place our assets uh, to gain an advantage over an adversary in any kind of warfighting scenario. And also metal is obviously really important uh, for um, the safety of both our assets, our capabilities, and our personnel at sea. With respect to our impact's mission of capable, adaptive partners, um, for the METOC community, this is an amazing opportunity to understand each other's respective um, capabilities in the METOC space, um, to share our products and our processes with a view to continuously uh, improving across uh, our respective navies.